Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. If you always watch our channel, you may know that Chinese 6G technology communication. Countries are stepping up the construction of 5G networks, and China has built more than 2.2 million 5G base stations. Although the 5G era has not fully arrived, China is already advancing the layout of 6G. Moreover, the central media reported that more than half of the world's 6G patents come from China, and 90% of them are core technologies. What are the breakthrough applications of 6G technology? The United States is also looking forward to deploying 6G. Is there a chance? More than 5G, China's 6G is also accelerating. The upgrade of each generation of communication technology can bring huge changes to people's lives. From 1G to 4G, communication technology industries such as telephone, SMS, and the Internet have been born one after another. People can use Internet technology to conduct video chats thousands of miles away, and can also learn what is happening around the world in the shortest time. These are the status quo of the industry brought about by the upgrading of communication technology, but the era of communication networks has not stopped and is currently moving towards 5G technology. In 2019, the three major domestic operators obtained 5G commercial licenses. Over the past few years, operators have built more than 2.2 million 5G base stations. In addition, China Radio and Television has also obtained a 5G commercial license and has become the fourth largest operator. It is currently promoting the operation of Section 192. It is estimated that it will not be long before domestic people will become the first users of China radio and television. Many people are still wondering whether to apply for a 5G package with 5G network, but they don't know that the layout of 6G has already started. According to news from the central media, Half of the global 6G patent applications come from China, 90% of which are core technologies. Such a proportion of patents makes China the world's number one 6G patent application country. At present, 6G is still out of reach for ordinary people because 6G networks will not be commercially available until at least around 2030. Moreover, the formation of a complete 6G standard requires the participation of communication equipment suppliers and operators from all over the world, and it will not be done in a short while. Of course, whoever holds more patented technologies will have more say in the future standard-setting process, and can even form a country-led industry development status. Just like American companies have mastered a large number of 4G patented technologies, leading the development of the 4G network era, and world-class giants such as Amazon, Google, Microsoft, and Apple have been born in the Internet industry. It's just that after the 5G network, the United States has obviously left behind its homework. On the contrary, Huawei, which started to deploy 5G 10 years ago, has emerged and won the world's largest number of 5G patent applications. It is also because of Huawei's 5G technology that it provides support for the construction of base stations for the three major operators in China in order to achieve today's cutting-edge 5G network progress. More than 5G, China's 6G is also accelerating. 90% of the 6G core technology comes from China, which proves that Ren Zhengfei was right. Ren Zhengfei, the founder of Huawei, said that Huawei is still the leader when it comes to 6G. Perhaps for 6G, Huawei has already taken action. The Breakthrough Application of 6G Technology and it should be noted that 6G uses space ground integrated communication technology and needs the support of satellites. Therefore, 
satellite communication will become a mainstream in the 6G network era. Huawei has already supported satellite communication in the Mate 50 series of mobile phones, bringing a heavy, piercing up to the sky, technology. This shows that not only the communication connections on the ground, but also the satellites in the sky, Huawei is also actively participating in technology research and development. So in the 6G era, what breakthrough technology applications will there be? Smartphone support for satellite communication is only one of them, and the focus is on bringing practical development layouts for smart metasurfaces, wireless artificial intelligence, and communication sensing integration. For example, smart metasurface technology can break the problem of uncontrollable traditional wireless channels and build a new network feature for 6G under the construction of an intelligent and controllable network environment. In addition, as a category of cross-domain fusion technology, wireless artificial intelligence has the potential to be deeply explored. In the process of exploring powerful perception and computing capabilities, 6G will bring the necessary intelligent application guarantee. These may be just the tip of the iceberg of 6G technology applications, and there are infinite possibilities in the Internet era. Is there a chance for the United States to deploy 6G forward? Some people may question that the 5G that is being vigorously built now has so many base stations, and the 5G network has also been opened. Why is it not much different from 4G? Where is the change of 5G? In fact, the real purpose of 5G is not to increase the speed of Internet access. If it is only for Internet access, 4G network is enough. The changes of 5G actually reflect all walks of life. The use of 5G in telemedicine, remote mining, smart factories and other fields can bring great industrial progress. Ordinary users may not feel much, but it is believed that enterprise users have already benefited from the 5G network and received support when carrying out various businesses. China has already distributed 5G to various industries, while the United States has been fiddling with 5G and wants to plan 6G forward. Is there a chance? It can only be said that it is not that simple. The development of a network technology cannot be deployed across the board. If the United States wants to enter the 6G era, the premise is to get 5G done. It's just that the United States is now complacent in the 5G field, asking operators to dismantle old equipment and install expensive equipment and the $1.9 billion they have spent is not enough. If the United States does not solve the 5G problem, it is estimated that it will have to continue to run with 6G. The development of network technology has reached the level of 5G. In the next 10 years, it will enter the era of 6G commercial use. China has started to accelerate from 5G. Domestic manufacturers such as Huawei and ZTE have consolidated the foundation of patented technology, and I believe that they will surely achieve greater breakthroughs in communication technology in the future. What do you think about this? Welcome to leave a message below to share.